guys welcome back to my channel so it is before 7 a.m. the kids are still sleeping um, and today I want to kind of do a video to tell y'all kind of like how I'm able to love myself so much a lot of the times I get asked Angel as a big girl as a girl with a lot of acne as a girl who struggled with self-confidence her entire life how are you finally able to completely love yourself and to think of yourself as a beautiful talented young woman and mother and I want to show y'all the things I've done the things I've implemented into my lifestyle and show y'all how I can make myself feel so much better about the person that I am. So step one, get out of bed before your kids, if you have kids. Get up before them so you have a moment to yourself. So both of them are still in sleep. They crawled out of their bed and got into mine. And the next step happens in the bathroom. So this next step may not be your cup of tea. But this is all about body confidence and falling in love with your body and the way you are shaped and the way you look as a woman. Get naked. I know, seems weird. But take off your pajamas, stand in front of the mirror while you're brushing your teeth, doing your hair, doing your makeup, whatever you're doing to get ready that morning besides getting dressed. Do it all naked while looking in a mirror. I don't know what it is, but the longer I've done this, the more in love with my body I have become and the more comfortable with my body I've become. And now where I used to just see spare tires everywhere, now I see a body that, yeah, needs to lose some weight, but that's still beautiful and touchable and honestly doesn't look half bad so I've grown more comfortable with myself clothed by being comfortable with myself naked so I'm not gonna film me being naked because that'd be wrong the next step after you've got your hair done and your makeup done and you're feeling good with the way your face looks you gotta wear the clothes that you really like doesn't matter what anyone says if a hundred people hate the way you dress or think you're too big or just think that that doesn't flatter you there are still 7.3 billion people in the world you do not have to get upset over the opinion of just the people in your local community a big girl if you want to wear a crop top if you want to wear jeans that have holes all through them wear it because I guarantee for every hundred skinny people or even super self-conscious fat people that say something to you there are going to be thousands of young women who are looking up to you and feeling confident because you're out there wearing something that they wish they could guess what they can you can we all can we can wear whatever we want we can look however we want so put on that outfit whatever it is and rock it because it's your body and if it makes you happy then screw the world part of my fridge all right the last step that I have to loving yourself to the fullest and being comfortable and happy with who you are is to blast music in your car on the way to wherever you're going in the morning and it needs to be music that you love to sing music that you grew up on music with happy memories behind it not sad memories you don't want to listen to sad music first thing in the morning For me I love 2000s music I just love 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 some 2000s music and I can turn it all the way up and sing as loud as I want if y'all have like a playlist that makes you feel really really happy in the mornings listen to it and jam it as loud as you can your kids may hate you and they may say "Ew, mom what is this crap but if it makes you happy that's what you need to do in the morning 
because feeling that joy is just going to put a little bit of pep in your step and every time you look at yourself in the rear view mirror or in your visor you're going to be like I like this person in front of me. I like the woman staring back at me. So that's it for my tips, you guys. I hope that this video kind of gives you some ideas on some things that you can do to be happier and healthier and just love yourself. And just remember, even if you're having a really hard day and it's really hard for you to love yourself, I love you. I hope that y'all enjoyed this and I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye.